We're located on the island of Maui in the state of Hawaii. What we do at the Pacific Disaster Center is we offer software solutions for emergency managers throughout the world. We address global natural disasters. So the big reason why we moved from AWS to vCloud Air was because vCloud Air, real easy. VMware is already there. We set it up, we get it running, we create our machines, we can take our machines from our on-site VMware environment and push them up into the cloud. What we use vCloud Air for our, our DR right now is that we have our main web page hosted on vCloud Air, and also we host our Global Hazard Atlas and other translation and thumbnail services. The main piece, which is our Global Hazard Atlas, is our main application where the public users can get information about real-time hazards around the world. This information is really useful to certain agencies when they need to know where they need to send people for disaster relief. One of the big things that vCloud Air provided for us was compatibility between our data center on-premise and off-premise in the cloud. Being able to move VMDKs between the two, moving templates using the vCloud connector, it's very simple compared to other services such as Amazon where I need to basically build from scratch again and then just moving data over in applications I need to rebuild again. Another thing that vCloud Air has helped us do is the ability to run development in the cloud our flagship application is disaster aware. So we're able to build this application in the cloud. From there, as long as our customers are using VMware products, we can pull it down from the cloud to their environment, spin it up, and we know that it's gonna work because of the compatibility between the cloud and the on-premise VMware environment. So one of the plans that we have whenever disasters are on our way to come, we do have offsite backups and we know with vCloud Air, if there's anything that we need to do, we always have VMDK backups that we can push up to the vCloud Air site. We know that they're gonna run, we know that they're gonna be compatible with the vCloud Air environment. So that's always a big, a big thing for us. If I know it's gonna work, the only thing I have to set up is the network and we're good to go. Our overall experience with VMware has been incredible. We've been very fortunate to have the support given us and the products are exceptional. We've had no issues. They've allowed us to come up to speed on getting machines up and running within 15 minutes, getting environments that would take us weeks up and running in hours. So we're really excited when we have to pick up that phone and talk to someone at VMware, we know we're gonna get someone and if they don't know the answer, they're gonna be able to get us the answer. For me, what I think that makes VMware very unique is it's uh, overall customer service and support and just you don't get that with the open source platforms at all. You're not going to get that high level, top tier support that you get with VMware.